Good morning, students. Today I am combining 17th and 18th day questions. These are all reasoning questions. You forward these videos to the your friends. These videos are so important. Now let's move on to the first question. What happens to the plant if the respiration rate is more than photosynthesis? For this, the answer is respiration is a catabolic process. Second one, photosynthesis is a anabolic process. The food oxidation is more in respiration than photosynthesis. The effect, if the respiration rate is more, it affects the growth and development of the plant and ultimately the plant may die. You keep in mind these points and write the answer in a proper way. Okay, let's move on to the second question. <coughs> Why do you think carbohydrates are not digested in the stomach? For the Digestion of carbohydrates, one enzyme is needed. It is present in the uh, saliva of mouth. It is a tylen enzyme. Tylen enzyme converts carbohydrates to the maltose. So, the digestion of carbohydrates starts from mouth. But in gastric juice, the digestion is not takes place because of tylen enzyme is not there. So, it is not digested in the stomach. The places where the carbohydrates are digested are mouth to a some extent and complete digestion is takes place in small intestine. This is the answer for the second question. You write it in a proper way. Next, third question. How do bacteria fungi attain their nourishment? For this question, the answer is the, they are saprophytes. Bacteria and fungi are saprophytes. They feed on dead and decaying plants and animals. They break down the complex organic molecules to simpler molecules. And these are the absorbed by fungi and bacteria. This is the answer to the third question. Let us move on to the fourth question. If we keep on increasing CO2 concentration in the air, what will be the rate of photosynthesis? This answer is rate photosynthesis is increases if the CO2 concentration increase in atmosphere. At a certain stage, the CO2 concentration rate and the photosynthesis rate is constant. A rise in CO2 levels, no effect on the photosynthesis rate. This is the answer for question 4. Students, speak to your friends. Next video is of diagrammatic questions. Thank you. Bye.